let us write a program to find the average of n numbers using array, where n can be up to 10. Create a new file in code blocks and save it as s5-01.c. Press Ctrl Shift N, press Ctrl S. S5 underscore 01 First, write the purpose of the program as a comment at the top. Program to calculate the average of n numbers using array. Include the header file hash include open close angular brackets stdio.h write the main function int main open close parenthesis void as parameter open close curly brace return 0 semicolon declare an integer array and four normal integer variables int marks open close brackets 10 comma i comma n comma sum equals to zero comma average semicolon prompt the user to enter n printf open close parenthesis semicolon within double quotes write how many numbers you want to store max is 10 store the user input in n scanf open close parenthesis semicolon within double quotes percent d for integer comma ampersand n use a for loop to iterate from 0 to n minus 1 for open close parenthesis i equals to 0 i less than n semicolon i plus plus open close curly brace here prompt the user to store the number printf open close parenthesis semicolon within double quotes write enter number percent d colon space comma i plus 1 store the entered number in the array scanf open close parenthesis semicolon within double quotes write percent d comma ampersand marks open close brackets i add the number to a running total sum sum plus equals to marks open close brackets i semicolon calculate the average which is sum divided by n average equals to sum forward slash n semicolon print the average printf open close parenthesis semicolon within double quotes write average equals to percent d comma average here we have declared the array with the statement int marks within brackets 10 then we read the number of elements of the array from the user and stored in n which should be less than or equal to the maximum capacity of array next the for loop causes the process of asking and receiving the numbers from the user to be repeated n times. The first time through the loop, i has a value of 0. So the scanf function will cause the value typed to be stored in the array element marks within brackets 0, the first element of the array. This process will be repeated until i becomes n minus 1. In scanf function, we have used the address of operator on the element marks within brackets i of the array just as we have used it earlier on other variables 
the statement sum plus equals to marks within brackets i causes each number to be added to a running total stored in a variable called sum. When all the numbers have been added up, the result is divided by n to get the average. To make our software more user friendly, we have started numbering from 1 while asking the numbers from the user as the users more naturally start counting from 1. Press F9 to run the program. Ok, we missed a equals to here. Run the program again. How many numbers you want to store? Let's say 5. Number 1, 2, number 2, 2, 2, 2, 2. So the average will obviously be 2. Alright, average is 2. Thanks for watching. See you in the next lecture.